Turkey is in mourning again after yet another devastating terror attack in the heart of its capital. Dozens were killed and more than 100 wounded when the suicide car bomb went off. Kim Mogyan reports. More than 30 people were killed when a car driven by a suspected suicide bomber blew up on Sunday at Gubin Park, a key transport hub in Ankara. Officials say the bomb hit a commercial area close to the Justice and Interior Ministries on Sunday evening, local time. The car came near us. Ten seconds later, seats from the bus that was destroyed came hurtling towards us. I was hit by a piece of metal. I just remember the car being black. A swarm of ambulances arrived at the scene and police helicopters hovered overhead as a large cloud of smoke rose over the city center. There was no immediate claim of responsibility for the attack, but Turkish security officials suspect it had been carried out by the Kurdish PKK or an affiliated group. The interior minister said they will release the name of the organization behind the attack within the next 24 hours. As a result of our investigation so far, important evidence has been collected, but the organization responsible will be announced after the probe ends. I believe the investigation will wrap up on Monday. Turkey's health ministry says the death toll is known to be at least 30, with more than 125 others being treated in hospitals around the capital. The death toll is expected to rise since almost 20 of the injured are in critical condition. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said terror groups were targeting civilians because they were losing their struggle against Turkish security forces. He said such attacks increased their determination to fight terrorism. The blast marks the second attack in Ankara in less than a month after a bomb attack hit a military convoy in mid-February, killing some 30 people. Kim Mogyan, Arirang News.